One of the, the benefits of the priority based budgeting process is, is the fact that it's so open and transparent and it really is a, a significant change from what went on prior to two years ago. You know, the community in Tyndrum is very different to the community in Pleen, which again is very different to the community in Strathblane and, and so on. And I think as a council there are opportunities here to um, listen more closely to what these communities are looking for. So the openness and transparency of the, the whole approach I think has been very much welcomed and it gives people, whether it's groups or individuals, the opportunity to actually um, influence the decision makers who are the councillors in taking the decisions that they've taken. I've talked a little bit about the desire to be much more closely aligned with the communities that we serve and that's particularly true but not exclusively of rural Stirling I think there's general recognition that, that, that some of the characteristics of rural sterling um, require um, special thinking and, and I think for me one of those things for example is the rollout of broadband. I think for the city, um, my ambition for, for the city is that it's, it's, it's very much a player in the national stage. It sees itself as being very connected um, in particular to Glasgow and Edinburgh but not exclusively. Um, there are companies here that do their business internationally and I don't think we should lose sight of that. So in five years time I think the city of Stirling will be a very vibrant dynamic place where sports, culture and arts are sitting hand in glove uh, with a dynamic technology um, business and sector uh, sitting alongside for example food and drink and I think by that point the, the, the council's role in that will be very much one of as an enabler of these things and well, I've moved to a certain extent from more traditional doing of these things. So yes, there's challenges, but I prefer to talk with confidence about um, a sterling that's recognised externally as being famous for its customer service, famous for um, being much better aligned to its communities, and famous for a, for, a, for a city that's punching above its weight and generating economic growth, in which we bring in um, some of the more disadvantaged areas and provide um, either access to jobs, skills training, or employment opportunities.